Go to that. We put a businessman in the White House. Let's put a businessman in the governor's mansion, huh? Yes. Well, there's there's so many so many people to thank, uh, and of course, uh, this is only the first step to turning around this state and taking back California for all Californians. I first I first have to thank my lovely wife Sarah. stood uh, at home taking care of our wonderful daughter, Julianne, uh, who's also a future governor, by the way. And I want to say hello, uh, a shout out to my other three uh, older daughters who couldn't be here today, uh, Sarah, Stephanie, and Jen. I love them as well. And I love all of you, and, and as well as our campaign staff, Wayne Johnson, our senior strategist, and Tim Bozellis, our campaign manager. Tim. Also a shout out to the bearded wonder, uh, Matt Shoup, our communications director, and uh, our fundraiser, Charles Moran. Uh, thank you, thank you so much. And you know what? The biggest thank you I'm gonna reserve for the voters of California. Thank you, thank you. And you know, the voters stood up for the special interests of this state who are trying to take this state down with them. We are not going to let them, are we? You know, the last six weeks, the special interest money, the corruptive nature of that was on full display for all Californians. Millions of dollars from special interest billionaires, they were spent on pretty nasty, misleading commercials. And they attacked our campaign, and I'm happy to tell you, they failed, didn't they? Yes. saw this repeated across the state in legislative races and congressional race, races. They wanted to limit the choice to one party. Well, I'm telling you, one party in Sacramento, one party rule in Sacramento is bad enough, but one party election is just plain on America. So I want to thank the people of California for standing up against the effort to manipulate our electoral system. And I also want to thank them for sending a message that we want to have a clear choice for the future of California in November. I just talked to Gavin Newsom, but let me just take a moment to send them another message. Mr. Mr. Newsom, Mr. Newsom made it clear that he wanted to, to run against me instead of another Democrat. Well, as I told him in San Jose at the debate, be careful, Mr. Newsom, be careful for what you wish for. Yeah. Mr. Newsom and his corrupt cronies made, uh, uh, they did a bunch of ads touting 